Have your eyes been feeling dry and irritated? Have you been experiencing a burning, gritty, or sticky sensation? Or have your eyes been unusually red or watery? You may have dry eye syndrome, an increasingly common condition that affects more than 18 million Americans, regardless of their age, lifestyle, or occupation. But you don't have to live with it. What is dry eye? In a healthy eye, tiny glands inside your eyelids, called meibomian glands, produce a complex oil that mixes with your natural tears. The presence of this oil stabilizes the tear film that moistens and lubricates your eye, washes away dust and debris, fights bacterial infection, and provides all-day comfort that allows you to see as clearly as possible. If these glands aren't functioning properly, or if other factors are at play, the tear film becomes unstable, fails to do its job, and may evaporate more quickly than normal. The result is the dry, burning, or gritty sensations people with dry eye experience and less than optimal vision. What else causes dry eye? Besides meibomian gland dysfunction, dry eye can be caused or worsened by a number of other factors. Being outside in windy or sunny conditions, sitting too close to a fan, prolonged staring at a computer screen, or exposure to smoke all can worsen dry eye. Medical factors also play a role, with diabetes, allergic conjunctivitis, or Sjögren syndrome commonly associated with this condition. Certain medications, like antihistamines and some antidepressants, can also cause dry eye. And contact lens wear is another frequent contributor. Although dry eye is increasingly occurring in younger and younger patients, it can also be a natural and common part of the aging process. How do you know if you have dry eye syndrome? Because many of the symptoms of dry eye are similar to symptoms of other conditions, like allergies, it's important to talk to your doctor if you're experiencing any of these sensations. If the true cause of dry eye is not properly diagnosed and treatment initiated, therapies like over-the-counter artificial tear eye drops may be a little help and provide only temporary relief. Worse yet, if left untreated, dry eye can progress over time, complicating therapy and leading to other problems like eye infection, corneal ulcers, and even corneal scarring. How can dry eye be treated? Dry eye is a potentially serious problem. The good news is that there are several ways to treat dry eye, so talk to your doctor about the treatment that's right for you. Since the majority of dry eye cases are due to meibomian gland dysfunction, common remedies include antibiotics, steroids, topical antibacterial treatments, helping the meibomian glands function better with warm compresses or by removing blockages, and specially formulated omega-3 fatty acid supplements. In some cases, prescription ointments or drops will be recommended. Some of these drops help bring needed moisture to the eye, but can take months to work and are very expensive. Antibiotic or steroid combination drops control bacteria and inflammation, but can be used only for short periods of time due to side effects. In-office treatments can include removing blockages of the meibomian glands through heat and pressure delivered by a thermal pulsation device, or by removing excess debris from the lids with a special exfoliator. But one of the most reliable, quick-acting, cost-effective, and patient-friendly treatments is Avanova Spray Lid Hygiene keeping the lid area supported. For this, your doctor may recommend Avanova.